Today I'm going to show you a pulled pork recipe, except this is not pork. So here I have some banana peels. And what you want to do is you want to wash them really good and then just cut off the ends. And then you want to grab a fork, okay? And you want to score the banana peel with the fork, just like this. Okay, so now once you get them all cut up into these strands here, almost looks like a little bit of spaghetti, what you want to do is you want to add a little bit of olive oil, about a tablespoon, about a tablespoon of apple juice, two or three tablespoons of a dry barbecue rub. And then we're just going to mix this up, get it all nice and marinated. And this is a great recipe, especially for vegans and vegetarians. And even if you're not a vegan or vegetarian, this is going to be really good. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're just going to wrap this up and we're going to put it in the refrigerator and just let it hang out for about 20 minutes. Okay, so it's been about 20 minutes and our banana peels have been marinating in the refrigerator. Now what we're going to do is we're going to get a saute pan ready. Okay, so I have the pan ready and this pan is cold because if this pan was hot, the minute we put everything in there, it would burn and we don't want it to burn. So to the pan, we're going to add some softened butter and then our banana mixture. And then we're just going to kind of work this in here. Now, once this pan warms up, we're going to keep it on a medium heat. And it's going to take about three to five minutes to cook. Okay, so this has been sautéed for about five minutes. And what I did was I actually turned my pan down as low as it'll go. So now we're going to add about another tablespoon of apple juice, about a tablespoon of Coca-Cola. And we're going to work this in here. Get all the nice flavors in there. Once again, very low pan here. And then finally, a couple tablespoons of barbecue sauce. And we're just going to work that in right there. All right, shut my pan off, and we're in business. Let me show you how I like to plate this up. All right, so for here, we just got a little bit of a bun going here. And we're just going to take this, and we're just going to put it right on here. Okay. And then we can top it off with some coleslaw. All right, let's get into this. All right, let's jump into this bad boy right now. Absolutely amazing how good this comes out. It tastes absolutely nothing like bananas. You'd think it would taste like bananas, but it does not. If you like this recipe and you think I'm bananas, consider subscribing. And for another good recipe, be sure to watch the video that's on your screen right now, and I'll meet you right over there.